Welcome to this video. Today I'm going to walk you through how to lock and or hide an application here in iOS on iPhone. This is a feature that's built in natively into iOS, so you will want to make sure that you are up to date with the most recent version of iOS on your iPhone. But to get started, what you'll do is just locate the application that you want to protect and or hide and just press down and hold on it until the menu appears. And if you look towards the bottom, second from the bottom, it will say require face ID. Just go ahead and click on that option and it will take you to this menu where you have two options. The first one says require face ID. What that means is every time a user tries to open this application, it will require face ID to open it. If you hit the bottom option, it will again require face ID, but it goes a step further. It will hide the application from the home screen. And this is very useful in the event that you want to make sure that users at first glance cannot find an application you don't want them to know is on the phone. For this example, we're going to go with hide and require face ID. So I'm going to click on that and it's going to pop up this menu. Note the message at the top. This app will no longer be visible on your iPhone except in a few places such as settings. This is true. For example, if you go to privacy settings, it will still list any hidden applications there as well as if you're doing application updates, it's going to be listed there. Just a couple places to be aware of. And then it goes on to say face ID or your passcode will be required to reveal open or use Siri with the app. And then below that it says obscured app appearance. So it's going to put it in a hidden folder. I will show you that here in just a moment. But the very bottom option is something you very much need to be aware of. No notifications, calls or alerts. If you're hiding an application that you use alerts with, those alerts will no longer come through. And so you will need to proactively check the application if you're going to hide it. I'm going to click on hide app and we can see that the application is now gone. Now comes the question of now that it's hidden, how do you find and use it if you need to open it up? To find and then open a hidden application, what you'll need to do is scroll all the way to the right across your home screens until you get to the app library screen and you will want to make sure that you are scrolled all the way to the bottom. At the very bottom, bottom right corner, it's going to have a folder that says hidden. Tap on it once and it will scan your face and then you can see the applications in there. If you need to open it up to see the full list, tap on it again and it will reveal the full list of hidden applications. And at that point you can click on it. It will scan your face again, just again, because it's protected by face ID. And at that point you'll be able to use it. I will note that if at any point you want to turn this feature off for a specific application, again, you're just going to press and hold the application until the menu pops open and then click on don't require face ID, which will both unhide and unprotect the application. That is everything for this video, but if you do have any comments or questions, please post them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please consider sharing it. And if you would like to support the channel, go ahead and hit that join button, the thanks button, the subscribe button, or that bell notification icon to get notifications on future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day.